let's take a look at some of the men that have lived in this fancy crib. You probably know me from the quarter and the dollar dollar bill, y'all. Even though I never actually lived in the White House, it was my idea to build it. Hey there, Georgie boy. You may have been the first president, but I was president, vice president, secretary of state, and still found time to write the Declaration of Independence. Take that, dollar bill, quarter, that's nothing. I was on the $5,000 bill. You recognize me, right? Honest Abe, the great emancipator, the guy who John Wilkes Booth shot? Yeah, I knew you'd remember me. Now let's get back to business. Four score and seven years ago. Oh no, not the Gettysburg Address again. And so, my fellow Americans, ask not what your country can do for you. Ask what you can do for your country. Now that's a quote, Jack. You always had a way with words. I cannot tell a lie. But I will tell you that I am the only president to resign from office due to my involvement in the Watergate scandal. I have to tell my story after Nixon? Yeah, now that's a tough act to follow. Speaking of acting, before I was president, I was a movie star. A movie star? Can you imagine the American people electing a movie star these days? Movie stars are great for endorsements, but let's leave the actual run in the country uh, to the professionals. Like me, Barack Obama, 2012. Oh no you don't. I want to be in this book too. So vote for me, Mitt Romney in 2012. I'm Basher, and I approve this message.